the Society of the Spirit World Warriors Observation Department? You got it. My name is Miriko Fujima. Very nice to meet you. What business do you have with the Nase family? I've come to see the Hollow Shadow. As I'm sure you know, it's incredibly rare for such a powerful Yomu. Dreams are the gateway to the spirit world. The phantoms that come from dreams known as Yomu are said to be physical manifestations of negative human emotions. They are born from people's twisted hearts, their hatred, jealousy, and malice. As long as people exist, Yomu will continue to exist as well. And with our ability to see them, we will continue to smite them. Don't you think that makes the job of a s- <laughs> Your meaning? As a spirit warrior descendant, I exterminate Yomu, but it's not a secret that I have a somewhat different view of them. You could say that I look at the Yomu in much the same way a fisherman views his fish. I honestly don't care what they are. I see. Uh, so it's a real Yomu? Come to think of it, frozen barriers were your area of expertise, unless I'm completely mistaken. How do you personally perceive Yomu? I believe we can prevent it from hitting the center of town. Really? Was that some type of barrier? Hardly. It's nothing that impressive. Looks like it's passed through. Hmm? Well, well, well. No wonder the society is concerned. Huh? Guess it looks like I'll have to pull back for now. It's true, isn't it? Ah! Perfect timing! You're Hiromi Nase, aren't you? I'm an officer from the Society of Spirit World Warriors. I'm Miriko Fujima. I was staying here observing as the Hollow Shadow passed through. You kids just caught me on my way out of town. I wanted to say bye to Miss Izumi personally, but I'm running kind of short on time. Give the lady my regards if you don't mind. Later. Until now, I had only heard rumors about them. Such a... In reality, they mainly issue spirit warrior identification. They also single-handedly gather and compile data on Yomu, which is kept from the public eye. You can think of their office as a city hall for the spirit world. Ah. <laughs> I've gotta say, deceiving a kid like that isn't really my thing. Yeah, but it looks like it's finally devoured enough Yomu. Now then, I guess it's about time I recovered the hollow shadow. Would you like a lift? I can drop you off. What do you want? Well, I just figured the two of us could have a nice little chat. I want to tell you about what you saw. Uh, that thing is... is a Yomu? Yep. Just like with the Hollow Shadow, many of the more powerful Yomu lack a physical body, causing their appearance to be very different. They are generally referred to as Beyond the Boundary. However, we're fortunate in that only a fragment of this one has surfaced thus far. Its influence hasn't spread. The Society of Spirit World Warriors has been keeping their eye on it for quite some time now. I believe your notoriously type-lipped Nase family has information on it. I thought I might be able to get you to share some of that information with me. But it looks like the baby of the family's been kept in the dark. <laughs> Please continue. What is the plan for subduing the Yomu you referred to as Beyond the Boundary? <laughs> Are you curious? Yaki Emo. Ah! All right! And you think that this is somehow linked to this beyond the boundary? Ah, can't say. But wouldn't you find it absolutely fascinating if it was? <laughs> look who's here. The way you followed your little sister out here kind of makes you look like someone with a serious sister complex. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you ask your little sister? That it's a distinct possibility. Izumi once warned me to be wary of the Society of Spirit World Warriors. How may I help a member of the Society of the Spirit World Warriors? I didn't think you'd discover me so quickly, though I guess I should have expected as much from a high-level Yomu. Of course not. I simply came to monitor the situation at hand, but now that it's come to this, I've got no choice. I'll be taking custody of Akahito Kanbara. Hand the boy over. I don't really have time to explain myself. Besides, I doubt you believe me even if I did. Well, well, looks like she's on a much higher level. 
But luckily for me, we're in the middle of the calm. Where do you think you're going? Even during the calm, you're still most impressive. But how about this? You're here early. <laughs> Looks like all the effort I went through to upgrade this into an anti-Yomu gun was for nothing. Guess I'm in a bit of a bind. You know me so well. I will not allow your plan to succeed. So I can see. I distorted the light. I've been conducting a little research. You like it? Looks like things are starting to get interesting. Somehow I had a feeling I'd find this here. Bastard! Now, now, don't worry. After all, I've only come to retrieve the Hollow Shadow's Yomu Stone. Rather fitting for someone such as myself. The Nase are fools. For some reason, they're under the impression that everything ended the moment the cursed blood vanished. However, after Beyond the Boundary was pulled out of Akihito Kanbara's body, it managed to escape death by fusing itself with Mirai Kuriyama's blood and stone in an attempt to defeat Mirai Kuriyama. It even went and created an isolated dimension. Now, I wonder what would happen if I were to amplify its powers even more. Well now, Miss Izumi. I hope you're paying attention. Uh Looks like it still hasn't eaten enough. Is Beyond the Boundary simply that powerful? Or is the strength of Mirai Kuriyama's will simply that strong? Clearly it's the latter. Wow. Well, you're not my type. You... You aren't the one I... You're running late today. It's grown rather powerful, don't you think? Though it wasn't until after I stole the Hollow Shadow... Hmm, so it's three against one, huh? No! Jeez, it's starting to get a little crowded around here. Now we don't have to worry about any more interruptions. It's just about time. It will devour every single Yomu and transform into a giant vortex before finally destroying the world. So, what will you do? <clears throat> Your younger brother and sister sure are persistent. Appearances, and it's all because of me! Are you really that scared? Oh, perhaps you've fallen for me? <laughs> or, or I want to keep your siblings from finding out about your past. Hmm? What's this? Aren't we the same? After all, we both harbor Yomu inside of our bodies. Did you know about that, little brother? Never be the same as someone like you. <laughs> you can lie to me, but you can't lie to yourself, Izumi. 